I will not be on next year's ballot by my choice. With that, it is official. Cook County State's Attorney Kim Fox says she won't be running for re-election next year. CBS2 investigator Megan Hickey was there for the top prosecutor's announcement. And Megan, Fox announced this decision after delivering what was a passionate defense of her more than six years in office. Right, Joan Marie, it was certainly a fiery nearly 40-minute speech by Kim Fox where she, she set aside two previously written speeches in favor of speaking from the heart. She addressed her critics, but she did not address the current exodus of assistant state's attorneys. I will be stepping down as state's attorney. Cook County State's Attorney Kim Fox isn't leaving just yet. Her term ends in November 2024. But 51-year-old Fox touted her office's emphasis at bringing equity to the criminal justice system, including her work on bond reform, vacating wrongful convictions. We cannot stand by these convictions. And expunging cannabis crimes. A low-level marijuana conviction does not mean that someone is a threat to public safety. But Fox spent much of her time calling out her critics, including those who have blamed her for a spike in crime in Chicago and Cook County in recent years. I refute the supposition that where we see ourselves today with the rise in violent crime that coincides with the once in a lifetime pandemic is somehow the result of the Cook County State's Attorney's Office. She also addressed what she called the elephant in the room. That probably when I leave this earth, my epitaph, my obituary will mention Jesse Smollett makes <laughs> me mad. Smollett was convicted in 2021 of lying to Chicago police about being attacked in 2019. But Fox's office dropped the original charges in the case. This case was treated like the other cases that have gone through our alternative prosecution model. Fox must go! Fox must go! Raising serious questions and criticism. Fox did not address the significant flight of veteran prosecutors in her office. Data obtained by the CBS2 investigators show 152 Cook County assistant state's attorneys resigned last year, more than any other year in the last decade, many citing concerns about leadership. But Fox concluded by saying she's proud of the work her office has done over the last six and a half years, but it's time to move on. And I leave now with my head held high, with my heart full. Now, when Fox was elected in 2016, she was the first black woman elected to the position of Cook County State's Attorney and Joe and Marie. She easily beat her challenger in 2020. Megan, thank you. Now, in a statement, Mayor elect Brandon Johnson said Fox, quote, has led her office with dignity and civility. And as a colleague at the county level, I am grateful for the work that she has accomplished in her two terms.